Hello friends, welcome back. I'm Faraz Sheikh and in today's video, we are going to learn how to insert data from picture in Mac. Well, I showed in a video where we can insert the picture using your mobile cameras, but this will be purely on the Mac. And for that video, I'll be sharing the link in the below video description. You can feel free to check out that. So let's get started and see that how can we do it in the Mac. So once you open Excel for Mac, once you click on insert, you'll find this nice icon, data from picture. You can just select from here and there are two options picture from file and clipboard so we're going to look both of them so let's look for the picture picture from file and i will select my picture image which is over here for class schedule right now i'm giving some free classes to the students uh, during the COVID. so that's the schedule for that class and it is analyzing the data awesome so it has grabbed the data which is in the table and nicely plotted over here. Now let us look what is this highlighted one. Uh, so it's an Indian time, okay, so that is correct. It has automatically detected correctly, except and there's a change over here in the date. If you can see, it is nicely dragging and zooming it. So I would just say that it is an August and make the correction and accept it. And I'll click insert data. Now, Excel is quite smart enough that it can automatically tell us that there are still some things pending for review. So you can just say review. So right now there are some topics which are over here. So I can just add some spaces and I will say accept. And the second one, which is over here. Okay, that's 230. So that's perfect. So I'll say accept. And now when I try to insert the data, voila everything is on my spreadsheet that is amazing and i can just put a space over here for microsoft teams that looks nice so these are the classes which i have given and uh, this is pretty cool you know i can see there are some two dots over here so ai engine is able to analyze like those are two dots but we can still do the changes in the review area so let us look another way like you can just simply add the pictures using your mobile phone so what you can do is just simply right click on any cell you'll get these options scan document or take a picture you can just simply hit on scan the document so the camera will automatically open and you can take the picture from your mobile but you should be on the feature called continuity for ios devices make sure that is enabled then only this feature will work out and let's go and grab some data from the clipboard now going to my website, let's say that we just wanted to copy this text, enter email and to take the screenshot on your Mac system, all you have to do is command, control, shift and four. So you can just scan this one, take, grab this clip. Awesome. So this time it is not in table, it's just a text. I'm taking it and I will go back to my Excel for Mac and this time we'll select picture from clipboard. So once you select picture from clipboard, it should analyze your data and you should get the records within any second. So here we have it. So it says nicely all that information and I'm just going to select the cell first and then I'm going to insert it. So this feature is quite amazing and I'm really surprised that why this is not available for the windows. We need it for windows. Of course, this is really a cool feature and this is available for mac i'm really happy all for my mac users and i'm a mac user so i'm quite happy on that but in fact i make a lot of videos on macs and windows so i really wanted to see this feature coming on windows as well so i tried to search a lot about this one unfortunately i couldn't find anything i tried to search like insert and uh, i couldn't find anything i just find that insert picture and insert picture from a computer that's just an insert picture you can just insert the picture you cannot get the data from that picture so i hope that uh, windows team will come back soon on this feature and it's very much needed on the windows also so i hope my friends you have enjoyed this video make sure that you hit the like button share this video subscribe to my channel and do let me know in the comment section about this video and in fact on my website you can go to my forums if you have any questions feel free to drop it out over here uh, you just need to register it and it's free you can just put up your queries over here there are experts who are handling the queries including myself 
so uh, you can even attach your files images and we'll be happy to answer you so see you in the next video till then take care bye